Right, so I was just browsing r slash gacha life cringe, burning my brain cells off, the thing you all love to see me do, and I came across a video posted on there of a very angry 13 year old, who was very angry at the click. You know, the click, the man who has a fantastic moustache. I even called him out on Twitter, trying to show off the power of his moustache via an editing mistake. You ain't slick, click. Proudly show off that bad boy. Sounds like you're jealous. But who would not be jealous of that fantastic moustache? Come on. It's amazing. But yeah, anyway, I guess this gacha kid was angry at the click because I guess he featured them in his gacha cringe video. And she starts off by saying, Anyway, before we get into video, I'd like to address some things. My friend showed me I was on a subreddit called r slash gacha life cringe. <laughs> Never heard of that. What, what the spaghetti is cringy about my videos? The answer is absolutely nothing. Also, I found out I was in a video from the click. <gasps> the cl not the click. Uh, like, geez, click. I thought you were cool. And I and I guess he called her a nine-year-old when in fact she is going to be 14 on the 29th. She even says here, also, I'm not nine years old. I'm legit turning 14 on the 29th. The, the 29th of what? June 2027? Oh, she's so angry. Oh. So mad, she thought the click was cool. Click, I, I don't know what you're gonna do here. They are, they are so angry. They are coming for you. I, I think the only viable option here for your own safety is just to delete your entire channel and move to New Guinea. I'll even start a donation page for you, which will be called Get the Click to Safety. But yeah, <laughs> but moving on, remember when they said their videos ain't no spaghetti, it ain't cringe? Well, they quickly move on to what their videos are about today. It's about bisexuals and pansexuals. Oh, boy, this is this is gonna be something. Get ready, gamer virgins. Let's start with bisexuals. Why do they even exist? Any bisexuals out there, wh why, why do you exist? What possible purpose do you have? This gacha cringe kid would like to know. How stupid can you be? You can't like both genders. Oh, they are coming for you guys. She then goes on to show possibly the worst example of how not to be bisexual, as if they understand what's going on. And then she then she then goes on to say bisexuals are just confused. So I have to ask, are any of you confused? Do you know who you are? What day is it? Then she goes on to talk about pansexuals, and it, <laughs> it's so funny what they talk about. Pansexuals apparently like anyone for their personality, which means they can fall in love with anyone, apparently. <laughs> and here's the gold, because they can fall in love with anyone for their personality, even a child. A child. No. Thus making them all creepy individuals who will go after children. End of story. Wow, that was... <laughs> <laughs> that was really something. Right, welcome back, Gamer Virgins, to another r slash gacha life cringe. As you can tell, I am thrilled to lose more brain cells by looking at what these gacha kids have come up with. It is so bad. Why do you make me look at this? I, I guess it's because I said I'm King Simp and I would take on gacha cringe. But you all seem to really love me looking at cringe. You even made me fan art where I am pouring eye bleach made out of spaghetti into my eyes. Literally burned away my eyesight. Thank you, baghead muffins. That's uh, very accurate. Someone also tweeted me a picture of their cat sneezing for some reason. I don't know why, but <laughs> thank you, weeb Mima. I do love animals, so it is much appreciated. As always, Gamer Virgins, please do not harass anyone in the Gatch community, as this is all for fun. Also on my channel, anything bad if you're new around here is known as Spaghetti. I, I, I don't know how Spaghetti became a meme on my channel, but I'm happy it's here. But hey, make sure you subscribe and you can also use the word Spaghetti to let people know that that is some bad cringe right there. With all that being said, Let's look at some gacha crit. Ma'am, all he did was cheat. Uh, okay, so what have we got here? We've got two people just sleeping and a very, very upset young girl. Oh, tragedy. But let's see what <laughs> let's see what creative way they come up with with dealing with these two cheaters, okay? Uh, okay, uh, they, they grab a friend and they're outside a house. Oh! <laughs> they just they've just blown up the house. Awesome. Cool. Okay. 
Problem solved. I imagine the person who created this it is just somewhere in their basement with no connection to how real life works and made this and was like, oh my god, I, I totally destroyed them. That will totally teach them to mess with you. I, I also don't condone cheating, but I also don't condone blowing up an entire house with people inside. I, I don't know, maybe it's just me. This one's just captioned as, uh... I killed my dad because he was gay. <laughs> hmm, I, I have absolutely no idea what to say about this, to be honest. It's just so bad. Killing your old man because he was gay. These these kids are something else, man. Dang, that's some nice abs you got. Where are they from? <laughs> Come on, man. <laughs> what is the most out of the ordinary thing in this picture? Is it the fact that he has cuts on his face and the girl's just laughing at him? Or is it the fact that he just has some ridiculously poorly photoshopped, chiseled abs on him? I mean, I laughed before because they used to, they used to just put lines there on their bodies and just make a hashtag. But I mean, <laughs> wow. <laughs> Boy I Rejected sent me this a few days later. Now I'm really glad I rejected him. Oh my, look at this, look at this fool. Delete feelings. Oh, damn, no, not your feelings. 1% on his battery life, or is that his life? I don't know, he's got a broken heart. I love you. To be honest, I've just realized I'm, <laughs> I'm laughing at a kid who's been rejected. Damn, feels bad, man, we've all been there. Uh, ahem, I am not your boyfriend, and Olive, Olive is transsexual. My boyfriend cheated on me with that transgender freak, so I am spaghetti. Is this the problems everyone's going through? I, I, I don't know, but... Unlucky, I guess. The end is near. Oh god, here we go. Why are maps treated so badly in society? Like, you're gonna encourage the LGBTQ for being themselves. Being a map isn't wrong. I mean, there's a big difference between, like, a, a map, someone who, who is like, I don't know, wants to go after young people, young people, let me emphasize that, and then there's people who are in the LGBTQ who are just normal people, who just have, just I guess, different interests of what they want to be with. <laughs> there's a big difference. Shut up and get in the bin. Excuse me, what? I'll delete if wrong flair. To be honest, I don't see the problem with being a pervert. Who are these kids? Where are their parents? I, give me their address, I will write them a very angry letter. What is, what is this one here? Just Roblox username, and then just, I don't even know what that says, then just currently having a depression breakdown. Have you ever seen that when people put like a custom set thing bio for their Discord, and it's just, you just look at it and you're like, what are you doing? <laughs> what are you doing? <laughs> you know, sort yourself out, get some help. Spaghetti is the gacha kid, Spaghetti19 apparently. I didn't smile once today. In my whole life, I think I have the spaghetti disease. Yes, because spaghetti, replacing this word, is a disease. No, it, it's it's not. Educate yourself. It's just, it's just, it just sucks. That, that's it. I don't, I don't want to misinform anyone, but it's not a great thing to have. Get, get some help, guys, if you have. Whoa, a male happens to be going to an all-male school. Say it with me. Trans men are men and trans women are women. A trans guy in an all-boys school. I mean, that literally just sounds like some really bad Netflix adaptation. They'll literally buy anything, and this is exactly what I'd see. And it's just, <laughs> it's just like, what, what, what's the problem here? What's the problem? Oh, oh, he's in an all-boys school. Goddamn. Just what the frick? Can you get pregnant from sitting on your boyfriend's lap? Yes, because. Every boy's lap is just, just <laughs> infected with things that make babies. Come on now, how, how old are these people? What, <laughs> what, what is this? That's gonna be it for today's video, Game of Virgins. I hope you enjoyed it and gave you the spaghetti that you needed. Be sure to follow my socials on Twitter and Instagram at itsben95 as I do love talking to you guys. Be sure also to subscribe as it's free and I ask regularly what subreddits you'd like me to look at. I hope you all have a fantastic day and I will see you all next time. <laughs>